हेलो फ्रेंड्स वेलकम बैक टू माय वीडियो लेक्चर माय सेल्फ भावना सूर्यवंशी आई एम फ्रॉम द डिपार्टमेंट ऑफ बायोटेक्नोलॉजी स्टूडेंट्स इन द लास्ट लेक्चर वी टॉक्ड अबाउट न्यूट्रासूटिकल वी टॉक्ड अबाउट ओकेजी एंड इट्स पोटेंशियल बेनिफिट्स नाउ टुडे वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द रेगुलेशन ऑफ अल्फा और अल्फा कीटोग्लूटारेट ओके जी ऑल्सो वी आर गोइंग टू सी डिफरेंट प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ ओके जी लाइक केमिकल स्ट्रक्चरल बायो केमिकल एंड फार्माकोलॉजिकल प्रॉपर्टीज ऑफ ओके जी सो हाउ दिस ऑर्निथिन अल्फा कीटो ग्लूटारेट इज रेगुलेटेड अक्रॉस द वर्ल्ड नाउ बिकॉज इट इज अ फार्मास्यूटिकल प्रोडक्ट it has to undergo some regulation so across the countries globally different countries have their regulations so for example ornithin alpha keto glutarate is regulated in a different way this is very important to understand students all the countries have their different regulations and they are acting and working differently for example in united states it is classified as dietary supplements so here in usa it is categorized as dietary supplements that you can take along with your diet and it is regulated by fda that is nothing but food and drug administration likewise in european union it is classified as food supplement so in usa it is uh, supplemented as dietary supplement supplement and in europe it is food supplement and it is regulated by european food safety authority efsa in canada it is classified as natural health product now see they are giving different names and their regulations are different although the functions are same but their regulations are different so in canada it is regulated by health canada and in australia it is classified as complementary medicine so along with your regular medicines if you are patient if you are suffering with some clinical uh, condition it can be given as a complementary medicine so and it is again regulated by therapeutic good administration that is abbreviated as tga now starting with the properties of this okg so first property is the chemical property so here in the screen you can see the chemical formula of okg c5 h12 n2o5 then the molecular weight of okg is 168.14 g per molecule cas number this cas number is a unique uh, number that is given by the pharmaceutical companies and it is uh, given by basically uh, chemic american chemical associations okay so this is uh, a particular number given to every pharmaceutical product okay then coming to the solubility of this okg it is soluble in water and in organic solvent also it has a melting point which decomposes like okg decomposes before reaching its melting point and the acidity constant where the pka value of okg is 6.1 why why these chemical properties are important students because it is been in some of the or some of the other formulation liquid energy bars okay so before modifying the product you need to understand what are the chemical properties okay so you can formulate in different formulations okay coming to the structural properties so structure because as in the previous slide we have seen that it is a it is in the form of salt okay so okg is uh, that is a salt that is formed from ornithin and alpha ketoglutarate and which is ornithin is one of the non essential amino acid while alpha ketoglutarate is a precursor of essential amino acid that is glutamine so it is having also a stereochemistry of both ornithin and alpha ketoglutarate l l isomers again for formulation the stereochemical properties are very very important so like amino acid they are they are seen in l uh, stereochemistry so here your isomers of okg are available and which is they have the same configuration of atom uh, around their alpha carbon so that is nothing but your isomers now what are the biochemical properties 
so biochemical properties starting with the metabolic role so okg is involved in several metabolic pathway as we have seen krebs cycle we have already seen apart from krebs cycle it is also involved in urea cycle and the synthesis of essential amino acid that is nothing but the glutamate so it is basically involved in anabolic pathways okay so second it is precursor of glutamine as we have already seen that it is also a critical nutrient in immune cell gastrointestinal tract and muscle cell because we have already seen the potential benefits of okg so their biochemical properties rise on these role it is also one of the nitrogen donor why it is giving a nitrogen to the metabolic functions so okg can donates its nitrogen group to other molecules and it is making a valuable source for nitrogen in various biochemical processes so donor in very uh, in many of the transfer reactions donor is necessary so here your okg is donating what it is donating the nitrogen group n group to the other molecules making the biochemical process possible coming to the pharmacological properties so in pharmacological properties we have already seen it is having the immunomodulatory function it is going to support the immune function it is going to protect the body against various pathogenic invasions or infections it is also been shown to have a good a very good wound healing okay so it has ability to enhance the wound healing it will reduce the re, uh, healing time and it is also very much recommended with the patients with severe burn uh, severe burns and wounds it is also having the potential to promote the muscle growth energy production it is also known to enhance the atp levels uh, or for performing various cellular function by supporting the krebs cycle and finally the uh, athletic performance that is some of the okg supplement is known to reduce the exercise induced fatigue so after the match after the event has done these athletics they are very much tired right so okg can be one of the powerful supplement these are the reference for today's uh, video thank you so much students